Seems like just a blink and you're back to see me again. What's up, my brother? So, then, what have we got? It's a star. It's the star. Hmm. Stars, stars in the night, sky, beacons of light, dreams of hope, purpose, or a reminder of our insignificance. Fear of despair, trust in the light of the star, with it comes clarity. Oh shit. And sometimes, proof. Remember, there's always more than meets the eye. Would you like me to show you? See more. I shouldn't have shot that guy, I think. Ah. Back to it then. Back to Hackett's quarry. Back to Hackett's quarry you go. Oh, the fun you'll have. Ah, they're allergic to light, dude. That's what it is. It was, it, it was, I, I, I don't even know what it was. It was so fast and, and there was a, uh, there was a hunter and it was just. Oh, Abby. Here. What? Oh, try drawing. Drawing what? Oh, uh, can you draw what attacked you? <laughs> oh my God, dude. Okay. <laughs> It's your go-to grub when Nick, you're guessing off hey, the glizzy. Buddy, what? You tell us what happened. What the fuck is that? I'm attacked. Where's Happy? Super out of it, man. We need to know what happened. All right. There was there was a guy there, but there was some kind of some kind of animal. The hell? What the fucking kind of animal does this? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Is, is Abby? Yeah, hey, she, hey, she's okay, dude. She's right over there. Oh, big claws. Teeth are on top of me. I think she was a bear. Full size bear would have crushed him. There's no way. I thought we don't get bears right here. Uh, Oh fuck! Look at that! Oh fuck. shit! That black stuff—that's that's infection. That's and it's it, it's spreading. This is bad. This is really bad, dude. High blood pressure, why not? Uh, so, uh, sorry. Okay. Nice. It's okay. Uh, fuck that. That's fine. It's no more better then. We should amputate. We should cut it off before the infection spreads. What? Hmm. You're an idiot. You're literally an idiot. Hey, I'm just trying to help. He just needs a doctor. Proper medical attention. And a shrink, too, probably. How, why is he like that? Uh, dude, why? What the fuck's wrong with you? Why are you so weird? He just got attacked by a fucking animal and he's bleeding out. And you're making fun of him? Gone. 
Yeah, you better run. Very brave. All right. I don't think you understand so, English uh, or what? Law just sounding pretty good right about now. Yeah. Shoot, don't shoot! I'm here to save you. Oh, oh shit. Everyone's gonna fucking hate him. Nick. Dude, everyone's gonna hate him when he tells us okay? that he took the thing out. Nick and Abby were attacked. In the woods. Hey, does anybody have any dry clothes? I'm, I'm fucking freezing. All our bags are still in the minivan. <sighs> Fuck, of course they are. Jacob, where's Emma? Oh, fuck! Oh, Jesus Christ! Um, I I left Emma on the island, and I told her I'd be right back. Ouch! Wait, what? Like the island? Yeah, why? Oh, no, I just I just thought I saw someone over there before. Someone? No, I, you know, I I don't know. It's it's probably nothing. I left her out there alone. Well, I think we're gonna head to the lodge. Also, why are you covered in what I hope is strawberry jelly? Oh, yeah, no, um, I'm pretty sure it's blood. It was this guy with like, um, he had like a bottle. Thing. I don't know, dude, it's like a really long story. Ew. Yeah. No, it's super what? Fucked up. What? What am I watching, dude? Oh, it, Jesus Christ, I can't believe I haven't told you this yet. I, I saw a fucking body in the lake. Like a dead one? Oh no, 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 no. Um one of the one of the swimmers from the varsity swim team, he got lost on the way to practice and it was Yes, a dead one, dumbass. Of course you did, Jacob. No, for real. I did. I, I figured it must have been one of the counselors that didn't show up, but I couldn't tell because it was like all you know, bloaty and gross. Something's not right. Gotta go get Emma. Uh, excuse me. Hey, I need this, okay? It's not safe out there. Dude, we gotta protect Nick and Abby. Yeah, and I need to save Emma, all right? She's out there alone. You don't even know if she's in trouble. You don't even know if you're in trouble. Are you trying to piss me off? No, I'm trying to save my girlfriend's life, asshole. Yeah, I don't think she's your girlfriend, dude. What? Does, it really, does that matter? Get. Oh, she's gonna shoot now. I have to let go. <laughs> real mess here guys you're acting like pricks both of you jacob we're keeping this nick and abby are injured we need protection there's someone around here <laughs> ryan sorry this is bullshit make sure she's this safe. is bullshit she's on the island she's definitely fine this is bullshit i did not hit her i did not and what risk another uh, run-in with captain deliverance no thanks okay there's probably another boat by the zip line either way i can make it to the island from there we need to get back to the lodge. Try to get help. It's not right. That's How? bullshit. We can't walk properly. Oh yeah, I have an idea. Oh my god, dude. The legendary wheelbarrow. That's nice. Okay. Let's see what today brings. Okay. Here's a riddle for you. What's got two thumbs and is suddenly riding solo on a freaky island in the dark? This fool. Well, one thumb. One available thumb. Okay. That was kind of cringe. Here, on a strange, uninhabited island that this brave young soul found herself. She's dying. For sure. My bad shot. She's dying. Okay, full disclosure. I've suddenly found myself on a, a strange, tiny little island all alone with nothing to do but show you guys around. So, there's a tree house over there. I'm gonna go and see if I can't dish out some of that sweet, sweet panoramic goodness. Because here's the thing. Not that I want to go back, because I don't. 
But even if I did, I can't because then I'd look like I'm playing solo. When Can he you play in a group? Who, who stormed off in the first place? No, I started. I started a while ago. No, sorry, I'm a bending. few a few days ago. Explore bending. You know what? Fuck it. Let's do it. To the treehouse, fellow explorers. No. Just fucking leave. Go back, motherfucker. You know, multiple people control different characters. Cringe. Is that you, Jacob? He's, he's an old bald man. How the fuck is that me? What's the deal? What's wrong with you? Why did you do this? Like, what's wrong with you? Or what? So this island is like an unexcavated part of the quarry that rewilded itself after it flooded into the lake. Pretty cool, huh? You know, when I was little. I used to think that islands just kind of would float in the middle of the water, kind of like an airbed. But I'm older and wiser now and realize that not everything's always as Holy fuck, dude. Kind of like how you thought you were just having a hot summer fling and then it turns into babysitting a big hairy man child who's all sad because you don't want to go steady with him and write him love letters every freaking day. And while we're talking about it, you don't mind that we're talking about it, right? Why? Why is it up to me to justify my feelings when he's the one who got all blah about it, you know? <sighs> the streets. Oh, look. A metaphor in the narrative. By mean of fork in the road. How fitting. Here's the big question. Do I take the high road, literally, and forget about it? Or do I continue on the path I'm on and keep ranting about my stupid dumb life. You know what? I think we're going to take that fucking no, high road so you shut the fuck up. Isn't live. The choice is up to me. Yeah, I think we take the fucking high road so you shut the fuck up and stop talking to the camera. Please and thank you. Okay, moving up in the world. Let's do this. Now you might notice the darling rustic vibes this walkway is radiating, and that's no accident. I don't know what y'all are doing with your walkways, but if you're not spending a full hour a pulling a splinter out of a snotty kid's finger, don't you dare call it authentic. Don't worry, the kid was fine. I'm a good counselor. And what doesn't kill you will make you stronger. Oh, is that how people are from America are in like high school and, and stuff? Or what? Is this how you guys are? You, are, you guys are high school and, and college? Is this how you guys speak to each other? I would fit right in an American school. I would fit right in. Holy shit, you sit there at a lunch and people start dancing on the fucking the tables and start singing and shit, like high school musical, and you're just like, yo, you guys cringe as fuck, dude. Holy fuck, it's bad. <clears throat> you know? This is where we're heading. Not too shabby. Well, literally is too shabby but these views oh man you're gonna blow your tops that's also crazy a zip line which Pickle -rick. i guess you can watch me crap my pants on that thing what the hell i'm here aren't i wait wait how does she have her how does she have her phone hard it won't know what hit it how does she have her phone we gotta get there and there's still so much to talk about wait what i don't understand i hope abby's okay she ran off earlier. If you didn't see it, I kind of sort of made out with Nick. But it was a dare. I'm not like a bitch or anything. Oh, oh in the contest, cap. Abby likes me. Well, actually, they like each other. In truth, I just wanted to fan the flames a little. Watching them stumble around each other like drunk jellyfish was exhausting. Holy fuck, dude. The poor kid was like a deer in headlights. It's cool, but though. But who would have Probably like the cringe He'll people, you know? I bet they're out there in the woods right now, just absolutely going for it. Yeah, no one asked. 
plus to your fat plus ratio. keys i think this might be one of those i'm sorry officer i have no idea what you're talking about situations so i'm just gonna go ahead and leave those right there why not take them and here we are as promised one okay. extremely rickety and you're six five yeah i'm six five tree house in another world, perhaps young Jacob and I would settle down here and play house together. And the random these characters, I Honey, actually don't know. I'm home. Oh What's God. that now? I forgot the children's bedtime. Well, now that's a fine. How do you do? Take it all in, folks. That's the summer camp experience right there. And oh, look. It seems seems somebody forgot to clear the place out. I guess one of the kids left their stuff, or maybe one of the guys back there. But I don't recognize this. Did you hear that? Looks like we have a choice on our hands. Do we snoop through someone else's belonging, or do we open the spooky trap door and die a horrible, painful death? I think we open the fucking trap door and you die. What do we need her for? Right? Let's be honest. Trap door. Let's go, baby. Goodbye, cruel world. The final curtain is calling and there's no time for an encore. Ah, actually, true. Ah. Later, bitch. Dude, that was good. Holy fuck, finally. Actually, the best ending. Best ending. Oh my god. Why are you smiling? Because, dude, she was a waste. She was a waste of Easy. time in my life. I got it. He's okay. Are you in pain? No, no, sorry. I'm just. I'm really hungry. We'll get you some food inside, okay? Yeah. yeah. Oh Look my god, dude. How no, it's never 100 bits, dude. Thank you. Six foot oh, man. Look at me. I can eat a horse. Well, I don't know if we'll be able to find you a horse, but maybe some granola? Oh, dude. Oh, yuck, I hate granola. <laughs> oh my god. This will open the nurse's station. Should be plenty of stuff in there. Well, hopefully we can just get him cleaned up for now. I'll get you something to eat. You and I are going to find a landline. Oh, uh, yeah. Um, isn't there one in Mr. H's office? Yep. We'll come nice. meet you. Copy that. Optimistic. I really hope they're gonna be okay. Do you think that whatever's left in the nurse's office is gonna cut it? Caitlin knows what she's doing. Does she? I, I mean, she wasn't even supposed to be working at the nurse's office this summer. She only filled in because some other girl didn't show up. It's better than nothing. <sighs> Come on, let's go call for backup. It's pretty weird to see this place so dead. You never came down here at night while camp was in session? What? No, did you? A couple times, yeah. Yeah. Where are you going? I... 
I, I I thought I just heard my name. I didn't hear anything. Oh no, it's the voices, dude. I don't think Nick's injuries are as bad as we thought. It's the voices, Chad. They're friendly, they're nice. Well, that's good news. Yeah. So what now? We gotta call for help. Who should I call? Uh, Mr. H? Better call Saul. The only number I got is to this phone. Okay, then 911. You mean 911? Who says 911? <laughs> anyway, yeah. 911. Should I ask for like police, ambulance? Huh. Just whatever, dude. Fucking rat. Cops. With guns, we need a lot of backup out here. So they'll say 911, what's your emergency? And then I say, uh, help, my friends may have been attacked by a bear, or maybe not a bear, but definitely an animal with teeth. And oh my god, you're wasting sure time, dude. You're there, wasting or time. How smart they are, so it's very possible they might be mounting an attack on us right now, and we really need backup. Yeah, yeah, that's that's good. Okay. Oh my god. And now, I was about to say, now they're gonna cut the line. Dead. Oh well, that's my weird. god, dude. Phones go dead sometimes out here. Right when you're about to call the cops, though? It's a coincidence. Can you try the hang up thingy? What? Here. What are you doing? I don't know. It's what they do in movies when the phone goes dead. Tap on the little thingy. We're not in a movie. Okay. Oh well, God. you know, how do you 70 know for this? Maybe that's just what they want you to think, man. Okay, oh, so my fucking God. No what am I watching, dude? No one has signal. Is there anywhere else in the camp that has a landline? Well, not a landline. What? The radio hut has some... Old broadcast gear. Where, where you do your announcements? Where I curate my sweet summer jams, yeah, and where I do the PA announcements. It has some old equipment there. I think we could probably break something up and get a message out. All right, yeah. Let, let, let's head over there and see if we can contact somebody. Put that back, Dylan. No. You gotta be fucking crazy if you think I'm gonna go out there without something to defend myself. It's more of a safety concern. Oh, do you think I'm gonna shoot my eye out? Or your whole head. Don't be a dick, man. I know how to use this. All Americans do. Don't worry about it. Okay. Uh, it's, it's probably the weather. Dude, what's wrong? weather, all? Ryan. <laughs> maybe, maybe it was the bears. Bear. And why does everyone blame everything on bears? Okay, so for the sake of argument, what if that bear that uh, cut our phone line and just cut out all the power, what if that bear is waiting for us out in the hallway? Fair point. Thank you. We should probably tell Caitlin that we're going to the radio hut. They're probably freaks. Yeah, okay, yeah, let's go. Yeah, we should probably leave that with Caitlin. Do you think she really needs it, though? Uh, she needs it just as much as we do. If she's staying in the lodge, we're going out there. You literally just said there might be something dangerous in the lodge. When? Like 20 seconds ago. Holy shit, dude. Okay, sure, but... That's because I really. They're funny, the dude. Just dude, what do you mean? The, gun, the funny, dude. Look at these guys. I'm cringing. They're not funny. Keep going. 
Ah, uh, all right. You're right. Hey, we'll still have mine. If you're extra nice to me, I'll, I might let you hold it. Don't write a check that you're asking cash. Oh, oh my god, dude. Too. Oh my fucking god. Oh, that was so cringe, dude. What? Oh my... Holy shit, dude. Am I interrupting something? Uh, hold my pistol, dude. Holy fuck, dude. Chin up, big guy. It, I wouldn't really know what to do with it, okay? I trust you. Good. Oh, thank you so much, Dylan. You're so generous and handsome. Yeah, no problem. Don't mention it. Shut the fuck up, dude. Who cares? Come on. I'm just fucking here to shoot some people. Come on. Oh, there. Oh, good to see you. Good to see you. We got two. <sighs> two things That's now. Time again, is it? Two things, chat. Strength, that's me. Strength. <laughs> Strength can be surprising. Knowing one's own raw power, tapping into it, tapping into a previously unknown energy. I suppose there are forces at work within us all. And with one hand it gives, and with the other. If I don't kill Dylan, i will run. Okay. The magician. That's me. The incredible, the unbelievable, the mystical, sensational. Perceptive manipulation. The work of a magician. Now you see it, now you don't. Blink and you miss it. And you wouldn't want to miss it. As always, there's more to see. And as always, the choice is yours. Would you like to see more? Of course. Choose one. Choose wisely. We like to see strength, right? Fuck the magician. Strength is way cooler. Oh my god. Holy shit. He's strong. So it's goodbye again. I'll leave you with this. Remember who your friends are. Remember who's looking out for you. Uh. Pog. Nice. Oh my god, let's watch some videos.